Hi, it's Amaranth Anthony, you can call me Robin, and welcome back to week three of my exploration in Two Eyes One. Um, I feel like I should do like a, I don't know what their like greeting thing is, whatever do I say, I want to go like Eyes One. Um, anyways, uh, if you are just joining us, you are missing out because last week we checked out uh, all of their Japanese, well, their main Japanese releases, as well as the music video for Fiesta and, uh, oh, another guide as well. So we, uh, yeah, we did a three, a three video special last week and all that will be in the card as well as stuff from week one where I checked out um, a couple of their music videos and another guide. So uh, today we are in for a single video. However, that single video, I don't know how long it's going to be yet. You guys know. Um, I'm, I'm guessing like 30 plus minutes uh, because I am going to go ahead and watch all of the dance practices that they released. <laughs> um yeah that's that's what i have in plan today so yeah a lot of you ever since i uh first started reacting to eyes one have been re uh, requesting that i react to their dance practices and um i am a fan of giving the people what they want in this series so um i didn't really want to pick and choose because um i don't have that much time this week um to give you guys another three videos so <laughs> i figured i would just make a kind of longer one and roll it all into one um rather than doing like two that are like 20 minutes more like a 30 minute one uh and then on top of that um, <laughs> i went right into the issue i had with um fiesta where i have a lot of you saying why didn't you check this out watch this one so uh i have a playlist pulled up here that i believe has their music videos uh let me get it in front of my eyes here it is um their i'm not the music video sorry their dance practices and um different versions so uh, some of these are spoilers for songs that I have not heard yet, and you know what? Honestly, that's okay. Uh, usually I would say never, no, I'm not watching it, but um, they have really interesting choreo and like the way that they go in and out of formations is really cool. So um, for once, I'm gonna um, not mind the fact that I'm having some songs spoiled for me, but let's go ahead and uh, jump right into it. So I have 11 videos here, so it's probably gonna be, yeah, about like, <laughs> uh, I'm guessing this video is gonna be like 40 minutes. So uh, let's see how true that is at the end. <laughs> uh, but let's go ahead and jump into La Vie and Rose dance practice. So is the album name Colorize? Because I feel like, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Actually, never mind. Okay, here we go. Yeah, they have like really interesting formations and stuff. I have been setting their names, by the way. I'm, I'm pretty confident. I'm gonna uh, show it off in the last, in the next week, but. I can play with like levels too. Yeah, you were saying they had like really like intricate hand movements. Definitely saying that. Eyes on me. Okay, I see it. I see it. I like how the back is like the lady does like. Okay. 
Okay, so clearly even from like the little bit I was seeing in the music videos, their formations are like, the transitions and stuff like that are really, really good. And the formations themselves. See, here's my problem. I think I'm getting Umbi confused with somebody, but I'm not sure. It's either that's either Umbi in the front right now or on the far left. I'm not sure. Something tells me far left, but you know, who knows? <laughs> All of you. <laughs> Ooh, we're going back to this. Nice. I'm just gonna let it autoplay. It's on a playlist, so we're just gonna go with it. Violetta. Oh, I'm interested for this chorus. Alright, here we go. Ooh, strong start. They're really good. Like they have like really strong lines. Like you can very clearly see all of their like I don't even know how to explain it. It's just it looks very clear when you're looking at it. Really play around with information and stuff. Really cool. Making use of their members. Okay, so is that Umi in the front right now? I will correct myself on screen probably, but I might forget. So that's my official guess. <laughs> Oh, 
I love how they don't end like, um, like they always end with like a little, like a like a little bit of motion. Like they don't just like stop on the dot. Um, it, it makes the I don't know the choreo feel like really nice that it doesn't just kind of end um, with like their type of choreography. Um, it just makes it look nicer. So I'm glad that they do that. <laughs> and again, I am not a, a dance expert or anything, so I can only give so much commentary over these dance practices. But I mean, they look good. I like it. They dance well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's continue. But that one was really good. I think that one, I like that one more than Livia and Rose, like choreo, choreo was. And this is what? Okay, Fiesta, okay. Okay. I love like the, the thing with the level, that's amazing. Blue dog's good. Like everyone, I how everyone has like their, their spotlight and like you know where you're supposed to be looking at all times. Backwards dance, okay. Oh, that leg. <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh, I love that. That's awesome. Like, they do really interesting. I know I keep like sounding like a broken like a broken record, but like they do really interesting stuff, like formation wise. That, like you know it keeps you interested even though like it may be like how many members in this group <laughs> 12 12 people doing the same dance but you know it keeps your eyes interested Like we always do that at the end, like softly, <laughs> rather than like on on point. Okay, this is pick me dance practice twelve. Oh, okay, this is the the iconic song. This one, that one iconic song. <laughs> The 12 member version, got it, okay.
Now, I've never watched any of Produce 101, but like, so I don't, I don't, like I didn't watch obviously the season they were on either, but um, it, this dance feels like they've done it a lot. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard this whole song. <laughs> now that I think about it. the other one. Never mind. No wonder. I think. Pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not the same one. Okay. If I find what I'm talking about, I will probably put a note on screen because I, I'm not sure what I'm talking about. But I thought there was a Pick Me song that was on Produce in 1 that wasn't this one. Maybe it's a different version each season. I don't know. I'm assuming this is like the song they did um, on the show with like all of the contestants. double time or something. I was like, oh my goodness. Not the, not the song, but the dance seems very addicting. <laughs> is the mama version of Livy and Rose which I need to rewatch now that I know the script more because I definitely did watch it but I watched it with the eyes of someone who had no idea what they were looking at <laughs>
You know what's funny is that I just watched the dance practice for the original version. I don't know what's different. I guess maybe there's a, like a breakdown or something later. I have no idea. I'm definitely gonna have to rewatch that later. Okay, now I don't know what the um, official title of this song is in English. Uh, I just threw it into Google Translate to say it in English, and it was up, up the sky, up, up to the sky, something like that. Um, so let's go ahead and get into it. Why is she not wearing like long jeans? <laughs> Oh, well, no, never mind. Dark long jeans. Dark jeans in general. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, high vocals. 
first time hearing this song, by the way. <laughs> okay, now it's Umbi. I can tell looking at her face when it's close up like this. <laughs> I don't like you getting her confused with, to be honest. That's the real question. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there's chaos happening back there. <laughs> nice to see this like less formal dance practice. Sounds like such a, a fun summer song. Off of. I'm curious. All right, this is oh my. Let's go. Can you feel it? Can you feel it? Come on. Do you watch me? Can you feel it? Oh okay, first time hearing this song too. Ooh, I like it. Move like transition to the back. Oh, I like this part. She really is <laughs> so tall. to the back. <laughs> Yeah. 
Oh man, if I listen to like the song, like official audio of the song, I'm definitely gonna have this stuck in my head. <laughs> Which wouldn't be the worst thing. <laughs> song too. <laughs> Alright, this is Spaceship close-up version. Okay, first I'm hearing this one too. B-side choreography is so much different than their like, like title track choreography. <laughs> like the style is the same, but it's so much more like fun, I guess. Like they interact with each other more and stuff like that. Ponytail on the top of her head? I think so, yeah, okay. This is so tiny. <laughs> When they do that at the end of videos, it's so cute. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna watch this one just because it's another close-up version and I just saw like the, the regular version so I don't think it's gonna be that much different so let's see what else we have. Okay, all right so the last one that we are gonna end off on today is the vampire dance practice so let's go ahead and get into it. Oh. 
I don't remember the quarry open this one. <laughs> I just heard it a little bit, but I don't remember it. Positioned so quickly. <laughs> like, goodness gracious. Oh, you're supposed to be, it seems like the hardest thing. <laughs> That's cool. Just stop and pose. Okay, continue. <laughs> This probably feels a bit different than the other ones. I don't know what about it does. I guess maybe because they're moving in like much bigger groups. Or maybe the movements seem like more pronounced. I'm not sure how to... Maybe because they keep going from like, from like big, like full group spreads to like more like individual. Um, or not individual, but smaller groups. If that makes sense. Yeah, the transitions are much like bigger, I guess, in this in it practice. Not that it's a bad thing, it's just it's way more pronounced. And it's okay because it kind of keeps the same energy, like the same like high energy throughout. Dramatic hair flip. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I like that ending. That was nice. A little different from their usual. They actually did stop like on the dot with that one. Um, but they kind of slowed it down right before the end. So that was nice. All right. All right, so that was me reacting to a bunch of Eyes One dance practices, and let me look at the time. Yeah, about 40 minutes. Uh, it might be a little less, um, but it'll probably be about 40 minutes. But um, yeah, that actually took longer than I thought it would. <laughs> uh, but anyways, I enjoyed watching all those. Um, I definitely see why a lot of you were requesting that I do, because um, they definitely have like a, a certain... I said it before with even like their music, but they have like a very certain style about them. And I've watched like a lot of dance tracks and videos for a lot of different girl groups. And um, they definitely have like their own sort of like flavor in that, um, which is interesting to see. So yeah, I mean... They're great dancers. <laughs> um, I think my favorite one is still, like choreography wise, is still probably um, Violetta. Yeah, that one was really good. Um, like I felt like the most like, oh wow, uh, after watching that one. Um, maybe followed by Livy and Rose and I don't know what will come after that though. I don't know, but uh, favorite one out of that is probably Viol Violetta. Violetta, I never know how to pronounce that with like Violetta, Violetta. I don't, it doesn't matter. 
anyways <laughs> um so yeah leave a like if you enjoyed watching that and let me know what funny videos i should get into for the last week of this exploration series which i'm like this is coming to an end already oh wow july really just like flew by huh um but let me know what other videos i should get into to learn more about the group and um specifically funny videos i usually save those for the uh, for the end like once i get all of their names uh i feel like i'm like 95 percent there with their names um i just gotta kind of work out a couple 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 other people namely and because i keep thinking she's people that she's not but i think it's like i think i know what she looks like and then we get into like actual like music videos or whatever and i'm just like is that her i i don't know uh, but i feel like i got like mostly everyone else so uh, i will i will uh prove myself uh next week so yeah i look forward to that um but yeah let me know what funny videos i should check out and i will see you guys then be sure to like and subscribe for um for more and if you enjoyed so i'll see you next time all right all right bye bye